To demonstrate Felix, a general purpose statistical reasoning system, the Hazy Research Group created Whiskey. Whiskey enhances Wikipedia with rich, structured information from a wide variety of sources. Let me share our very early prototype of Whiskey with you. Wikipedia is an information system that has high precision, but low recall. Wikipedia is high precision because all the information in Wikipedia is carefully organized and validated by human editors. For example, Barack Obama has a page, and Wikipedia knows that his wife is Michelle and that he went to Harvard Law School. These facts are entered into Wikipedia and then curated by Wikipedia editors. There are billions of people who are not Wikipedia editors, but generate a massive amount of content. Billions of web pages, news articles, videos, etc. Barack Obama is mentioned millions of times in this massive pool of content. There's a tremendous amount of valuable information about Barack Obama that is not in Wikipedia. That's why we call Wikipedia a low recall system. In the Whiskey project, one goal is to improve the recall of Wikipedia. Whiskey is supported by a system called Felix that performs statistical analysis on large data sets. At this early stage, Whiskey has already processed tens of terabytes of data from half a billion web pages and over 200,000 videos, and is performing deep semantic analysis on billions of sentences. The page you see is Barack Obama's page on Whiskey. You can see that Felix found Barack Obama mentioned in 200,000 web documents, in 1.8 million sentences, and in tens of thousands of videos. Whiskey creates a page for every person, place, or thing in Wikipedia. Search engines understand text at what we call the mention level. They do not understand concepts like physics or relationships like Barack and Michelle Obama are married. Whiskey is able to understand content at the entity or conceptual level. Let me show you an example. If you click on the Related Entities tab, you will see a list of entities that Whiskey considers to be most related to Barack Obama. Here we see United States, John McCain, Hillary Clinton, etc. The data we have used is a snapshot of the web from 2009 provided by ClueWeb. That's why John McCain is so high on this list. Now let's click on Hillary Rodham Clinton to see a list of sentences mentioning both Barack Obama and Hillary Clinton. Let's look at the second sentence. Has he forgiven Barack for trouncing good old Hill, otherwise a shoe-in for heading the demo ticket into this election? Here, Felix is able to correctly recognize that the word Barack refers to Barack Obama, and the word Hill refers to Hillary Rodham Clinton and not Lauren Hill, nor Hillary Swank, nor any other Hillary. Felix makes this decision by examining all conflicting information and combining it using probability theory. Whiskey is also able to find relationships between entities. In Wikipedia, popular pages have an info box on the right-hand side that lists relationships between entities. Here in the info box for Barack Obama, we see a list of many facts his presidency, senatorship, birth date, spouse, etc. On a regular Wikipedia page, you won't see those red buttons. Those are generated by Whiskey. If you click one of those red buttons, Whiskey will tell you what facts it has read on the web that support a particular relationship. For example, Barack Obama was a U.S. Senator. If you click this button, Whiskey will show you sentences from the web that confirm that Barack Obama was indeed a senator. These highlighted phrases helped Whiskey to extract such facts. Besides reading text, Whiskey is able to watch videos and understand what people are talking about. Here, Whiskey says that Obama went to Harvard Law School, and Whiskey has some video to support this. When you click this play button, a YouTube video pops up. Wait 20 seconds or so, you'll see why Whiskey finds this interesting. Here we go. Now, 10-year-old Gabriel sees a man from a mixed marriage running for president. I think he's really cool because he looks kind of like me. And um, <laughs> if he's elected, I feel like I could be elected to president too.
They have something else in common, too. His mother is from Kenya, just like Barack Obama's father. And his parents, like Barack and Michelle Obama, went to Harvard Law School. But all those things in common... Did you see that? Whiskey understood what the guy was saying and found evidence that Barack Obama went to Harvard Law School. If you want to, you can scroll for more videos about this relationship. I want to stress that it is non-trivial for Whiskey to understand correctly what people are saying and connect mentions like Obama to the entity, Barack Obama, represented by this page. These features are possible only because Felix is able to perform deep statistical analysis over massive amounts of data. So far, Whiskey only shows facts that are already in Wikipedia. In the near future, Whiskey is going to contribute to Wikipedia with novel facts that Wikipedia itself hasn't covered, and eventually, brand new Wikipedia pages. Imagine a Felix-powered robot writing Wikipedia articles from scratch. This is the end of our quick tour of Whiskey. As I've said, we are still at a very early stage, and we have processed only 500 million web pages and 200,000 videos. While we continue to refine our technology behind Whiskey, we will also expand our data sources significantly. We hope that very soon Whiskey will be processing the entire web in real time, exploiting millions of videos, books, and speeches, as well as other data sources containing valuable information. I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for Whiskey's new vertical application that we plan to release by the end of January.